This is Alwood from Alwood's Photo School. This is film three of our restoration class. We're going on to still talk about levels of fading, but now we're talking about a classic problem for most people who are trying to restore all photographs. We're going back to the 1970s, 80s, and early 1990s. And this effect, this slightly orange in color, is caused by well, several things. One of the most common things was very, very cheap paper. This was um, Agfa paper, which at a time in the UK when this was taken was a very cheap process and the end result was in time it fades really quickly. The other thing that does this is if you have albums where you're putting sticky glue soaked um, plastic over photographs, the acid in the glue affects the photographs and causes this. We haven't changed colour. What has happened is the colours have faded. All photography is made up of red, green, blue. And some of those colours fade really quickly. The colours that fade the first are the blues and greens. And as they fade, they leave the reds. Hence why we have this. So let's work on the same idea. Now, we can do a few things more of this. Oh, by the way, this corners like this is a trademark from England. Um, you used to see this in Australia too. Very, very cheap processing. They used to use this as like a novelty of these curved edges. Yeah. Moving on. We're going to fix this image. Now, we're going to use the same technique we used in film two, the auto levels, which was um, enhance. And again, auto levels is up there. Shift, control, plus L. Or just press it from here. I'll press it from here this time. Three, two, one, and fix. It can be as quick as that. We've still got a degree of orange, but the orange in the background, that's the time. This is 1980s English houses. We had lots of wood and lots of orange there. The main thing is the colours fixed correctly. I'm going to go on to the next film.